Uh, hey there, Brian here. Uh, today's video is about motivation. And uh, honestly, I think I'd rather be doing anything other than sitting at a computer and staring at a screen and doing research and, um, you know, being productive. Even though I know I need to be productive and I need to get stuff done. So that's what this video is about. Stay tuned. I, uh, I could rake the yard, uh, you know, need some work. Nah, I, I, I don't want to do that. I, uh, I could finish uh, staying in this chair that my wife started a couple days ago. Um, but, uh, you know, I got orange slices instead that I think I could eat. That sounds better, getting my hands dirty. Mm. So you might even find yourself in front of a video game console, uh, idling the time away, playing your favorite game. Hey, uh, no judgment here. I've been there. And uh, I might have been there like just a few minutes ago. Hey, 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 what are you doing? Uh, nothing to see here. Uh, move along. My point is this. Um, at some point, you have to give yourself a break and say, I've been doing a lot of work and putting a lot of energy toward my courses and all the other things that I'm doing in my life. And maybe I need a half hour to be able to hang out and just focus in on maybe doing some things around the house or doing some video games or those kinds of things. Whatever works for you. But if you're an English 101 person, you at some point have to think about this final essay that we're going to be doing together. And you're going to have to sit down, excuse me, and um, Think about the six total sources that you need um, to be able to put together this research essay. Remember, six total sources. Of those sources, uh, one is an article that we look together, look at together. Uh, there's an interview portion as well that you guys know all about. And there's four other sources that you're going to be researching on your own through academic databases. But really what this process is about within this last third of the term is just giving yourself the time and energy that you need to be able to put together longer research projects. It's all about the time. So refresh yourself as you need to, take minutes and moments for yourself, but then also when it comes time to start working, try to do it a little bit before the actual due date of the essay. So maybe start a couple of days, maybe a week ahead of time as a way to do that research and think about asking and answering a really interesting question. So give yourself time. It's all about the six total sources for this final essay. Thanks for watching this big idea video. I'm Brian, the host of this little show, and we will see you in the next one. Yeah. That's, uh, that's permanent marker. Yeah. Yeah, that's permanent marker.